Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel Ray and today I have a really special unboxing for you. This I've been waiting so long to open. A few months ago, well last year, uh, I spent the late summer dyeing yarn for my friend Heike and we decided that we were going to do like a gift exchange of yarn for a kind of a mystery advent for each other. And so I learned how to dye yarn and I had a really, really good time doing that and like learning all these methods and stuff. Now, I've kind of since learned that it's not really something that I'm going to be doing because there are some really, really talented people out there who are great at it. But and I'd prefer to just buy it if I can. But it was a really good experience. So sh this is her gift from her to me. And I'm really, really excited. This is my Christmas present. So join me while I uh, open this up. Oh, I don't know how special this is. Oh my goodness. Ah. <laughs> Look how cute. Um, I'm going to read the card first because, you know, you don't want to be rude. This has been sitting here for so long. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Heike, you're so talented. Oh my god. That is so cute. Do you see the little sequence? Now she colored this herself. Ugh. Put the sequins in there. The little glitter flakes. How cool is that? Oh my gosh. Does it open? Yes, it does. Okay, I'm going to read this off screen. Oh my goodness. Okay, so this is a, a beautiful little card. Um, there's no particular numbers to them. Um, there was a plan that went a little bit down a rabbit hole, but I'll explain that once you've opened them all. <laughs> <laughs> um, and unfortunately this did not get to me in time to open before I left so now we get to open them all at once which is probably arguably even even better <sighs> you even included something for Luna I should have included something for Lola and Nelly okay if you don't know who Heike is she's stone cold coffee crafts on YouTube she does diamond painting knitting and cross stitching and she used to do a lot of um, paper, paper crafts. Aw, look, it's a, it's a rawhide kind of bone thing. My first instinct is to actually smell it. I'm not going to do that. Luna. Luna. Luna, come here. You want a treat? You want a treat? <gasps> That's for you. It's a pretzel shaped bone. See you never. <laughs> She's loving that. She's going to take that back to her bed and eat it all. All right, let's see. Oh my goodness. All right, so there's all these yarns and then I see stuff at the bottom. I think I'm just going to go in order from top to bottom, but I'm going to push that box so that we can see these properly. Thank you so much. This is so sweet. Um, I'm super excited. I want to make something really special with this. So let's see what she gave me. The first skein. <gasps> oh my goodness, it's so pretty. <gasps> Oh, wow. I love it. These are so my colors. Thank you so much. Oh, it's so pretty. And it smells good, too. <laughs> you did such a good job. How did you do that? Oh, my goodness. Okay, so, yeah, I know I'm gonna, I'm gonna love this no matter what, but, you know, because it's Heike, but, okay, here's number two. I gotta think of what am I gonna do with all this yarn? What what should I make? Should I make another shawl? I was thinking about making a poncho or something. Because I like wearing ponchos. Like the one I've worn on my floss tube before. <gasps> Whoa, that is pretty too. Look at that beautiful, like 
fuchsia-y, magenta-y, like, I don't even know what to call this. This is a super vibrant rose. Wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> ah, it's so pretty. <laughs> Does she know me well? They all go together. Of course they go together. This is Heiko we're talking about. She's like the queen of fade. She loves herself a good fade. And sorry about the sniffles. I'm having a bit of an allergy attack today. Let's see. What's this one? What color do you think it? Oh, I ruined it for myself. <gasps> That's so pretty, too. Oh, wow. How did you do this? <laughs> These are so cool. Wow. And, and like these colors are so me as well. Like, yes, 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 yes. Dark pinks and purples, cause pink is not my favorite, but purple and pink go so well together. Yes, yes. <laughs> this is so cool. Oh, what a great idea. I like this even better than like the mini skein advents. This is just incredible. But of course, like, if you're going to do a gift exchange with your friend, make sure that like the rules are really, really set down in stone. Like you know exactly what you're doing so that one person doesn't feel left out or feel like they gave too little or something like that, which I'm starting to feel like right now. Because <laughs> these are amazing. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Ooh, I got a fur. I got, a, I got a little of fur. Yay. It's staying in there. I'm keeping that. <gasps> pretty this is like a nice plum color yes yes <laughs> all right last one i left this one for last because it was the the odd one the one with a different tissue it probably doesn't mean anything it probably just means that she ran out of the other paper <laughs> knowing her okay or this is the christmas day one but she said there's no order, right? So let's see. <gasps> Whoa, that is so cool. Okay, I, I see it now. All right. Well, maybe, maybe, huh? I like it a lot. This is so cool. <gasps> she said she wasn't like prepared to do speckling. I was like, girl, <laughs> you got to try it. This is so cool. I love tonals too. So that's from Heike, the beautiful yarn advent that we decided that we would do for each other. And I'm so happy and it's so squishy and soft. Ah. <laughs> Yay. All right, let's look what's in the rest of the package because yeah. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Here's some more wax for me to try out for my um, whip or wax battle. Battle of the waxes part two. And some snacks. Yay. So princess pretzels. Ooh, they look good. I love that rock salt. Uh, yeah, I'm going to hide these from James. I'm going to hide all this from James. Thank you. Ooh, Rocky Balboa chips. <laughs> Pizza Philly style. Hmm. Hmm. L.A. burger style for Apollo Creed. That's interesting. So Chio is like a brand of chips. I'm going to have to try these, aren't I? I'm going to try them. Why not? They're a few months old now, so I better get into them now. Let's see. Mmm. Smells pretty good. Whoa. <laughs> That does taste like pizza. Cool. That's yummy. Now having a sweaty Sylvester Stallone on the bag kind of puts me off a little bit. Not gonna lie. Mmm. Okay. What's this? Wasabi trips? <gasps> she told me about this. Dude, okay. Yep. And try it. Wow. Look how green they are. <laughs> All right. Happy uh, Patty's Day, everybody. Look at that. 
Oh man. Ready? Mmm. Oh my god. This is the best thing ever. Well, these are really good. James is not gonna want these. Mmm. That's such a great idea. It's like cream cream and wasabi. It's in English. That's funny. <laughs> I guess that's not too weird though. What's this? <gasps> Starting Tom! Yay! So she's passed past the stash. This is a Lindy Stitches chart. And this is Strutting Tom. He's a little turkey. See him? He's so cool. I didn't get this, but I, she, well, I was, once she had stitched it, I was like, oh, that is really cute. Can I stitch it too? So she passed it on to me. So I'll, I'll send it back when I'm done. These are terrifying jalapeno and cream cheese inferno. Yes, I'm opening all the chips. They look like normal chips, right? Let's try them. Cheers. Whoa. Mmm. James is going to love these. Well, he's really going to like them. They're really good. I wish we had all these chip flavors here. And this one is pulled pork burger flavor. I know I'm gonna like this too. Look at look how flat it is. <laughs> Yay. Thank you for all the chippies. Look at all the grease on the box. <laughs> all right, let's try this one. What is it again? Pulled pork burger. Mmm. Interesting. I'm not so sure about that. It really does taste like a pulled pork burger, but I'm not so sure about that in a chip. Yeah, I'm not so sure about that. I need to cleanse my palate. Mmm. That's really good. This is even better. I'm going to have James try some. Oops. I better pick that up because I don't want Luna to eat it. Thank you so much, Heika. Mmm. Thank you for all the chips. <laughs> and thank you so much for dyeing this amazing set of yarn. I think they go in this order. They could go in this order. Which way would you put it? Would you put them, like, put that in the middle? Ooh, that's pretty, too. You can play around with it. I mean, it doesn't have to be perfect. Not meant to be, right? Nothing is perfect. And this card is going to be with me forever. So this is my third card from Heika. And they are all so amazing and beautiful. Thank you so much. I'm going to put this with my Christmas decor, and I'm going to keep it forever. <laughs> Thank you. Let me see if I have something else that I can open just at the end of this video, maybe a little bit more friend mail, and I'll be right back. The box, this one comes to us from Margo in Wisconsin, and I'm excited to rip this open. I don't want to show her address, so I'm opening it upside down. Aha! She knows how this goes. Let's see, we have a card. Oh, that's so pretty. That's lovely. I'm guessing this is from Christmas. Oh, how adorable. Merry Christmas. Sorry, you couldn't see that. Oh, it's so cute. Maynard the Santa Moose. Cute. Okay, let me just read this. Rachel, I'd like to thank you so very much for helping me get through this difficult year with you. Your amazing videos, I feel a kinship with you. Ah, as I was away from the U.S. living in Wales for a short time, and I lived in Virginia as well. Oh, cool. I made these bracelets and necklace for you. <gasps> Margo, thank you so much. Oh, my gosh. I can't wait to get into them. Let me see. <gasps> thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, those are adorable. Look, the washi tape job on that is so cute. 
Let's see. <gasps> wow. Oh my gosh. How pretty. Let me get it all straight. <gasps> that is adorable. I love it. Wow, you've done such a great job. And look at that. Oh, that is so pretty. You're very talented, Margo. I don't think I could do something like that. That is beautiful. Thank you so much. Oh my goodness. <laughs> wow. I feel totally spoiled. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Let's see what these bracelets look like. <gasps> wow, look at this. Oh, that is so beautiful. These are gonna up my, my outfits when I do eventually get to go out. Let me just put this aside. Those are gorgeous. Holy cow. And you just bead these together? Oh, and that's cool. That's like a little jeans clasp thingy. You know, that holds the corners together. Oh, they're all like that. That's so cool. Wow. Those are so pretty. Thank you. I love these beads. Those are, those are amazing. They're like super textured. That's cool. Awesome. Thanks, Margo. That is so cool. And your card is amazing. I'm going to keep this. And then hopefully, um, maybe I can use him for um, my little... I'm making a stitching book. So all of the little small stitches I do, I'm going to put them in. So maybe I can cut that out and use it on the opposite page of a moose. Which I am stitching a moose. Somewhere. Anyway, thank you so much, Margo. I love them, and I'm going to treasure them. I'm going to put them in a very safe place and wear them on special occasions. So thank you so much, and thank you for watching my videos, too. While we're here, I'm going to go ahead and open another package. This is from Terry Marie in Australia, South Australia. And I love to get things from Australia. I'm so excited. Thank you so much, Terry Marie. Well, these are all from Christmas time, so don't be surprised if they're themed. <gasps> Look at them! They're so cute! Oh my goodness! Okay, let me read the note first. I don't want to be rude. Okay, this might take a little while. I can see that this is a letter. Excuse me. Ah, thank you so much, Terry Marie. She gave me some ideas on how to decorate diamond painting pens to make them a little bit more blingy. So I might have to bring that to the channel. Thank you so much for the idea. And look at these little tiny... I love plushies. They're so cute. An emu and a koala, right? That's an emu? Maybe? Let me check. <laughs> I could be wrong. It doesn't say... Ooh. 100% recycled plastic bottles. Cool. That's that's wonderful. So the fill of them is is recycled materials. And this koala is so squishy. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. Ah! I should make like a a little um shelf where I can put all of my little stuffed animals from you guys cuz I have so many now and they are really cute. <laughs> I know I'm like a child, but I actually love them. Thank you for the stuffies. Thank you. Let's see what else. What else we got? Ooh, there's lots of little packages in here. What's this? <gasps> Ooh. Okay. It's a cover minder or a needle minder. Pretty. Oh, look at that bird. Little patchwork bird. That's so adorable. Thank you. That's very spring-like, which is perfect timing. I'm going to put it here on my board behind me. I've got a little cookie sheet. Ooh, two for Rachel. Remainder giveaway. Okay. Have an impromptu giveaway. Ooh. Aha, uh -huh. so this is what she was talking about. How cool is this? Wow. So she uses washi tape and then E6000 to make these really cool textured pens. Holy cow, those are so cool. That's amazing. I'll have to bring that up in another video because I have to decide which ones I like the best and they are all pretty. 
So I like them all <laughs> and I want to keep them all, but I won't. Thank you so much. They are gorgeous. Wow. I'm going to put them right here so we can both look at them if they don't all roll away immediately. <laughs> Let's see what else we got. Blue for James. One for Rachel, one for subscriber. Oh, wow. Look at Terry. <laughs> look at her. She is so thoughtful. She knows y'all are watching. Let's see. Ooh, so this one's for James. Ooh, how pretty. That's nice. Oh, and it's a notebook. Cool. He's going to like that a lot. I wonder, how did you do that? Very cool. Dressing up notepads. One for me and one for a subscriber. Those are neat. Look at that. So it is a cool way to use up special drills. Just your extra special shaped diamonds. And dress up stuff like this. That's a great idea. Really good idea. And I can see that you painted this with gel pen. Very cool. Oh my gosh. He's going to love that. Thank you so much. Those are so cool. What else we got? One for Rachel, one for James, and two extra to give away if you want. Ooh. One for me and one for James. Oh, wow. These are, these are actual writing pens. That's neat. Cool idea. I love that. Thank you for showing me how to do that. I really, really like that. I bet that's really relaxing to coil washi tape as well. Very cool. Thank you so much. I'll definitely be sharing those in a future video. So pay attention. <laughs> and you may end up winning one of these things too. I'm not 100% sure whether I ordered this or not. So this is going to be interesting. Let's see if I can get this open. It says it's from Address Pal, but I think somebody was sending me something through that service. I'm not sure. Let's open this and find out. <laughs> Try not to show their address either. Ooh, what's this? Okay, bye. Pretty. See, what's it say? Merry Christmas! Yee! Ooh! <gasps> Wait! Is this from my secret Santa? Let's open this. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay, so that's the bag empty. We've got some Maltesers, yes, awesome. Some Snips, very nice, very spring-like. I like that a lot. And then look, 40 count even weave, wow. That's really tiny. <laughs> 36 count even weave, oh, look how pretty that is. I don't think you can see this, there you go the subtle variations of this kind of like really light hint of purple and then light blues and medium blues. Got some John James needles. A 27 count even weave. Ooh, that's a pretty color. I like that. 28 count even weave, small piece. It's very pretty. A 32 count even weave. Very springy. I really like that. I'm sure I can find something nice for that. And then we've got this 28 count we even weave. Thank you so much. Now the label said Gemma. So Gemma, I really appreciate it. I don't remember ordering it. So I think it was a gift because it came in this bag. And I think that you might have been my secret Santa. And I don't see any note in there or anything. So, I don't know. Hang on, let me check the box. 
Nope, there's no note in the box either. So thank you very much. These are really, really beautiful fabrics. And I know that I'll find something beautiful to put on them. So I really appreciate it. Thank you so much. And thank you also to Terry Marie, to Margo, and to Heika as well for sending me all these beautiful goodies. I cannot wait to use them and love on them and I really appreciate it. I'm going to cut it here for today because I don't want to keep you forever. I have a lot of friend mail to share with you so there will be more Thankful Thursdays in the future. Just you wait. Um, and I just want to say a really big thank you to everybody who did send something and maybe you're waiting for me to open it. Uh, thank you for your patience. Um, I will get to it as soon as possible. Uh, thank you, thank you, thank you. And I'll see you all really soon in my next video. Have a great day and a great week ahead and I'll see you soon. Bye!